everybody. Uh, I'm Saberwolf, and I'm joined with uh, One Free Fits. Hello. Good a afternoon, evening. AKA Cold Drizzle sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> that always messes me up during the uh, Potion League stuff, you know? Yeah. One day I'll unify the names. Yeah, one day. Uh, but yeah, so we what we got we got something a little different tonight. Um, since uh, kind of we're kind of really the only people that kind of showed up for restream, so we kind of like you know what? Let's try something different. Let's do a team race. Try to, like it's another pitch that a couple people had in the Discord. If you want to check out the Discord, go over to ff6wc.com. Uh, go over there to click on the Discord link and join us there. And also, by the way, Twitter is back up and running again. I just want to make sure I get the right name for it again. It is... Uh... Oh no, I lost it. <laughs> Sorry about that. It is uh, FF6 underscore WC. Uh, so the Twitter is back up and running again to let you guys know updates with races, with leagues, with things going on like that. So that's back up and running. So I guess, how about you join? How about you explain what, what exactly we're doing here? <laughs> yeah, so I think the general idea is we're going to be sharing information uh, back and forth uh, to see just kind of, you know, if one racer is good, then two racers should be better. Um, so we'll be talking about interesting things we find in shops, uh, interesting loot, and we'll likely be diverging in the checks that we go to, um, and having a great time along the way. Yep. So one of the things we about team racing, we were thinking is that we could have like one, uh, two, maybe even three players, uh, racing the same exact seat, same exact time. And communicating each other on what what's where and what where why how, and then as a team score, either the fastest person counts, or the la or the third person or the second to last person counts. Kind of like what you have in cycling, I guess, because mm. in cycling competitions and Olympics you have like group racing, where yeah. it counts like the first. I think it's like a four person group, and they count the first three people. Uh, across the line, I believe. So I guess that you can call it that um, as kind of a thing. So I guess we could say which of us finishes last is the time that we pick, I guess. I guess what we get on the first. First or last, what do you think? Um, Let's do, let's do first. Let's do first. First? Yeah. All right. I think in a two-person team, first makes more sense. I think when we get we do larger numbers on a team i could see like dropping the top and the bottom and taking the middle two or the middle one something like that but we're kind of making it up so drop just, top no i'm sorry yeah <laughs> just try it out <laughs> and see how it goes all right all right and again we're not racing against each other we're racing with each other so new concept um kind of like a loser's first tournament which is wrapping up. We're in the latter stages now of that tournament series, uh, coming and hitting to the grand final. Um, and kind of like you have a coach that's with you and you're communicating back and forth. So that's that kind of that same, I guess, vibe. So let's get this thing going. I guess we've talked enough, so let's get this thing going. Yeah. <laughs> I am you want to count ready. down or? Make sure uh... auto tracker is going. There we go. Okay, it's going. Oh, by the way, if we end it, by the way, if we end up with Mog Yamaro and something else, we'll we'll reroll it. <laughs> if it's like Mog Yamaro, a gal, we'll reroll this because right. obviously there's gonna be not too much communication, not much to do. So. Here we go, three, okay. two, one. Go. All right. Ooh, it's girl. Okay, we're not rerolling because it's my girl. <laughs> um. I'm gonna head to the world of ruin right away. All right. Uh, oh, stray cats on cyan. Oh, nice. More. I like that. Stray cat on cyan. Oh, marshals on cyan as well. This is actually not bad. Uh, 
Where are you going? I'm going to World of Ruins, South Figaro first. Alright, I'll check out Marsh. Let you know it's in the uh, trap chest. Because, of course, we want that more menu music, too. <laughs> Uh, although they listen to your stream, I guess they don't hear it anymore. There is a uh, flame shield in one of the boxes in South Figure or World of Ruin. Alright. That's a Tell Star. So that's a new set. It's in one of the boxes. Okay. On the, so on the bottom left side, or? Yeah, bottom left. Uh, monster chest was a Telstar so just... There's a force armor in the bucket basement of South Figaro. That one's the same on both sides, I believe. Uh, yeah. Ooh, earrings in the far room of uh, Narsh. Nice. In the starter starter room, far room. Just the ether in the other one. Nothing really cool about it. Going to the treasure room now. Um. Oh yeah, let me know about the Celeste check, because that's a free check, right? Oh yes, yes, yes. Ooh. I'm on my way to that very shortly. 20 grand in a dragon a claw uh, in the treasure room, so it's worth. With these Ooh, commands, um, like a good weapon and like offering, for our stray cat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Schwann's in the chat, for sure. Mm hmm Yeah, we need to find, uh, snipers. Mm-hmm. Oh, there is an enhancer in South Figaro Ruin Weapon Shop. Enhancer, that's pretty good for us, unless... for now... Uh, warp stones and smoke bombs in sleeping bags in Narsh World of Ruins. Very nice. There's well, pretty, all the tools. All the tools. Pretty similar in uh, World of Ruin, South Figaro as well. Okay. Oh, dragon boots and earrings of Narsh World of Ruins. Boots and earrings. I'm gonna write that down. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if we get a thrower, that'd be nice. It just makes those stones. Yeah, that would be nice. Alright, I am. Yeah, yeah. So, so unlike basement. other races, guys, we are looking at chat. So, um, should we shout out and talk chit chat with us? And our per I got both our personal chat and my regular chat. No, I couldn't I buy it. I didn't have enough money. Yeah, if I have money, I would buy um Ragnarok is the check in the basement. For Celis. Oh yeah, I think Orlance was also in the weapon shop. Which Zion cannot use Ragnarok. Celis can. I'm being jammed up by the uh... <laughs> ah classic. By the guard. Um, yeah, avoid. Oh wow, three empty chests. I'm gonna take a in fight the, in the uh, basement of South Figaro. See what's there. Do not go returners. <laughs> Skip it. Campus is the basement spawn I got. Yep. Um, if you go to the returners, only go to the urn by the clock in the lounge because that's the only thing that's there. It's just a wing. Makes sense. Is there meat at 
returner shop? There is dried meat at returners, yeah. Okay. But that's it. Uh, the back room where the guard is, there was three empty chests. Even thousand of them. Yeah, I'm a big fan of rando tuned swamps as well. Yeah, I just because we're not doing like official race, I just want other random tunes. Plus, we were talking about um, <laughs> uh, copyright issues <laughs> with Final Fantasy VI. Yeah. Too, so, because YouTube seems to trigger those um, iconic music tracks, like uh, Dancing Mad and such. Yeah, there's a pretty decent uh, enemy fight in the basement of South Figaro. Oh, so don't get levels there. Uh, there's a thunder shield down there too. Oh, but I mean for levels though. Oh yeah, it's about 1500 experience. Well, I don't have any progression right now, so. All right. Ooh, there's a gold hairpin in the deep basement of South Figaro, but that's the only chest, and that's the north chest. There was also a thunder shield down there too. What was the Celeste check? Uh, Ragnarok. Uh, yeah, that's not gonna work for now. I mean, it'd be good for Celeste, but not for Saiyan. Maybe we can use her. I'm gonna go... Loot... Miranda. Oh, I, just, I am an Albert fan. Or, or Albert? No, I'm Albert. Albert. I'm an Albert right now. Different worlds? Alright. Different worlds, different places. Oh, more earrings. <laughs> That's the only thing in the shop is earrings. <laughs> there was literally nothing else in the shop that's earrings. Well, wall ring. Right? The uh, end barrel is not worth it. Oh, it's different for... Yeah. It's different for... It, it's different. Yeah. It was still <laughs> nothing. Uh, safety bit was the clock in the relic shop. Yep. Armor. Skip the armor shop. Uh, ooh, Skyrender. That could actually work with... Goldberg. That's decent, that's decent, yeah. Um, I don't think... Uh, I'm gonna pass on boots for now. Skyrender could buy, that's pretty pricey. Yeah... I got barely enough. Nope, I'm still 200 short. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> Why? <laughs> Alright, my bucket is gracious. Fine, I'll sell an ether. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I got a sky render. <laughs> the weapon shop pot is emptied, so don't check oh. it. Too late. <laughs> no, I didn't listen. It's kind of, it's You're definitely so... <laughs> challenging to like, kind of play and. Uh... What are we thinking about going with three characters here? Well, I think uh, one of us has to go with Go Go. I'll go zone. Go... I'll go zone eater. Go zone. Check zone. I'll sign up. All right. All right. I am going to go to World Balance uh, self fig now, I guess. So I can pick up my rag for Celeste. And then I can also get my uh, Thunder Shield, and there was something else in the box you said right here. Ah, uh, there's a gold hairpin. Thunder Shield, you need... Oh, Genji Glove, too. Oh, more earrings. Just... Every shop has earrings, what the hell? Nice. Oh, my God, these guys are killing me. He said there's a golden hairpin over here. Yeah, that oh, one's in the, the, uh, barrel. In the And that one's in the basement, so it's a thunder shield. Alright. Yes, engulfed first try. Yay! I can't remember if you told me to ignore the box. Did I buy warp zones? I did, okay. Oh, of course I remember. <laughs> right. My bad. Damn. Um, do 
Yeah, for those of you following along, um, this is Oh, a... there's an Illumina in Zone Eater. Oh, jeez! Like, and a, in and the a bar and, and on the double chest bridge. Oh, oh, I got first try across, too. I'm gonna save after oh. that. <laughs> Wait, on the top part of the bridge or on the fall part? Uh, the top part. I did not fall. Oh, wow, okay. Um... Let's, let's, see, that let's see what else is in here. That's gonna jam me out. Brick cap. That would actually be helpful. Oh, huh? nope. I'm just gonna go. Uh, uh, I sense I'm already in here, and I feel like we're gonna want that Illumina. I'm gonna go check that out of the way chest. On the, all the box jumps, maybe it's right. something crazy. I think it's a rename gonna... card. <laughs> oh, yes, so good. Um, now I guess, I guess the next question is who wants to do leader and who wants to do uh, opera house? Because I haven't gotten any levels yet. I was thinking about doing opera house. Uh, I'll take I'll take leader. Kieran oh, is the expert. shields. Which has scan and magic power plus two, so. Zone Eater is the place. Okay, so never mind. I'll go to Zone Eater first, then, so I can get that uh, magic power for Sigils. So we get her going. Uh, if I'm gonna do Leader, I need to go back to Little Balance. All right. Was there anything different in World of Ruin top side on the figure or not? So there are earrings in the Narsh stuff, right? Yeah. Uh, ear I think all, all the relic shops have earrings, actually. Like, all the world balanced relic shops have earrings in it. <laughs> you can't go wrong. Pick one. Figaro, Narsh, Tasma, just pick one. Music is pretty cool. I forgot this was a little room, I think. Yeah, yeah, Narsh music is pretty key. <laughs> Also, have been putting off Narsh early in seeds. Uh, it is pretty popular though, so sometimes that burns me because I miss like something sweet. Was the uh, treasure room worth going to in uh, Narsh? I just jumped through the leprechaun's body. Um, yes, it is. Okay. Um, it's worth, um, oh. the clock, too. The elixir clock. Oh, and, yeah. Um, it is also worth. Nice. It's a lot of worth money loot. Yep. And, um, only the, in the starter's lounge, only the farm is worth. Heard. Alright, I'm gonna head to leader after I... Um... <laughs> Get the rest of my party back and then head the leader. I almost just went there. Almost got squished. Okay, then I did that. Sounds like you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> my controller doesn't want to cooperate. <laughs> Why? Oh, um, the extra chest outside the room is amazing. Uh, yeah, that was a rename card. Oh, that's definitely shops, worth. So, 
That was definitely ooh, shit. Go to uh, uh, our craftsman. All right. So how are you feeling about our like our pace so far? Oh, it's okay. Um, I think we have to double back on a couple things, but so far we're doing good. A hairband is better than leather. Oh, we need a. Except for the Illumina, Celeste is pretty. Uh, that's got like okay. no gear. Leader is Rexol. Leader is Rexol? Yeah. That's not horrible. And either a character or an item. I'm just gonna chill, go, go. Um, it's gonna take me a while for uh, Opera House because that's so okay. slow just my level, so. Um, Where are we thinking of um, next checks since while we're doing well, these fights? I, I mean, if Depends. you want to do Mount Zozo, it's up to you, <laughs> but if we only have one Esper, there's no reason to go there. Oh, wait, I haven't started the. Shoot, I forgot to start the scene. I forgot the dragon, you don't have to start the scene. Oh man, I didn't even equip shields. Yeah, make sure you put a thunder shield on Celeste. Yeah, that's what I was just saying. <laughs> yeah. It's like, um. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, Lumina Thunder Shield's good for now, but oh, she's got nothing for head gear or body gear. Okay. Alright, there's no timer. That's fine. Um, Mount Sozo, maybe, but if you only have one Esper, I wouldn't go there yet because you want to do the dragon. Right. Um, so. I would probably do maybe dream and get all your espers there, then go that. Or or magic or, facility. Yeah, we, other. I wonder yeah, if we, we should split those two just to see. Uh, Stray was the esper from leader, and it is pretty bad. That's not good. Bonus and a crappy spell. Yeah, but it counts to the pool. So yeah. maybe we'll put that on the back foot, I guess. Oh, Rasp is the spell. Um, Cat Scratch on Gogo -Go from the back row doing 450 damage. Nice. <laughs> I think I'm gonna head to Magitek. Yeah, you, I would. Yeah, you don't. You think it's a straight boss fight still. I'm a, I took a that I took a fight in the basement of South Figaro, so I'm kind of I'm a, I'm ahead of scaling right now. I think I can I think I can rock this. What kind of fights are in the opera house? Uh toe cutters. Ooh, those and are they're kicking my butt. Pretty high. I'm not rocking anything. I want to get experience off our house experience. Nice. But, um. Just to see what Vector Shops have in offer. Well, I keep getting Doomsickle, though, that's the problem. Persian and a Bloom Shell is the, op is the alternate fight. They're finally a wind slash block. Good job. There is a white dress in Vector, but that's the only thing of note in the shops. That's better than nothing, and that's magic power. Right. Celeste has very low speed, by the way. She's slow. Heading into Magitek now. Dream's gonna probably do Dream then off this. I've never seen a mouse go that way. What the heck? Get some funky moon 
Moon walking mice. No, he's like he's like just standing next to uh, the Ultros. I think I ran into that in like practice earlier. It's it's weird. Oh, Sky Render plus um, Sky Render plus Cat, Cat Scratch at level eleven, thirteen hundred damage. Okay. So definitely Sky Render. And that was an Albrook World of Balance shop, I remember. Hey, first time Jet there, uh, Ken Lanen. Pretty good. How is the music getting randomized like that? Um, we have an option to set our Discord, which you could do, uh, and and tunes uh, that adds uh, various music from other games like that. Uh, you can do that in our Discord. Just go to ff6wc.com and go from there. <laughs> well, is the Opera House fight. Which means I can't, um... I can't really... The, uh, first M-Tech boss is Air Force. First M-Tech boss is Air Force? Ooh. Well, Bolt, well, we got the shields. So yeah. Cool. I should auto-kill it. The scaling is still pretty low, too. I'd rather face Air Force early than the statue. I am got glued, <laughs> so I'm just stuck right now. That'll be good if we can find that in the weapon. And for defense in general. <laughs> Vanilla music is the drop down music? Okay. Vanilla airship. House was Scarlet. With, oh, I forgot to put my screen. X Zone. Esper has X on that's all it is. It's stuck on it. Oh, there we go. I threw a true knight I found on Go Go and it, he just jumped in front of a head. Hero Go Go. Uh, boss 2 and Magitech is the, uh, is that Ultra Spore? Chupan? Plus ultras. Oh, no experience. Well, I'm glad I put uh, it's a red cap. Then. Is reward too. On the first or second? Second. It's Bahamut red cap. I'm gonna go all the way. I'll take the. I'll take the fights. Right. Um, You're going to dream. I'm in dream. There's a red jacket on the side. Of Which nobody can use. Great. <laughs> so helpful. Safety, safety save. Before I get on the go kart. Mine kart. Didn't they have a. Oh no, that was the street. That was the racing one. Jacket is pretty dope. Yeah, but nobody can use it. Glitches. Oh no. <laughs> wow. Oh, okay. We need to get out of this. Oh, bad. Uh, uh, ooh, okay. 
we had a morph with a muddle followed by a morph but then a scan was the result of that now i know all about gogo <laughs> um, ultros that's where i showcase uh, liches are resistant to fire where's my straight cap i keep on doing Chaz asking if you, you use memory cursor. No, I don't. Uh, it's definitely this. not for this time because everybody's just using fight. Ooh, siren. With life three pearl on it too. Nice. I had no magic power. I have gotten zero magic points in this game. That's rough. <laughs> so all I have is those four things. Because all the bosses I've faced have no. Uh, Setzer is the dream reward. So there's our character. To... The gambler. Yeah. Which is actually good because that gives us um, two quick checks right there. You're still, but you're, you're still working on... Uh... Yeah, I'm on the minecart still. Okay. And I've done that for you. Pretty decent experience fights on the, on the cart. Yeah. But they're both espers, right? Uh, Alright, so one was a red cat, though. Yeah, number two is dead. And we got the uh, beefy boy himself, Fun Baba. Poon oh. Baba. Poon Baba is finally doing leg day down the tracks. <laughs> yeah, I guess. I don't know how he's running in those legs. So. Alright. Nice. We found a better weapon for Goku. Um. Well, he's kind of scouting. He's doing Ultra Three. He's doing Meta Three to scout it, see if it's worth. Like, if, like if we can get like a Realm X magic or something off of it, then I'm definitely going. Two. <laughs> Returner's music is the uh, dream music. <laughs> Against yeah. double limiting. I'm going into I, spice, still learn nothing. A lot of times I do go through Magitek 3 because I've noticed that it feels like a majority of racers don't. So if I find something there, I'll get an edge. Chat was asking. Alright. Should probably do a better job of <laughs> context. Yeah. Uh, there we go. I am not propping cat scratch like a ball. Yeah, let's just say. H2 Dunalona. Zone Seek is the final reward, and Leader is the boss. Wow, that's that leader is dead. Sorry, what was the reward? Uh, zone Seek. I haven't looked at what it's got yet, but... Oh, nice. <coughs> so, two espers off of the entire match type of season. Yeah. Should I go to Zozo just to see? Because I know you got a, you got a character in. I mean, um, you, you get the espers, you can start learning stuff. Uh, Setzer has cast zone Seek has horrible Merton. magic. Sensor has nothing. Uh, okay. I'm gonna. I'm gonna 
you might want to consider that one. I think I am going to go to Mouse Eyes, though. Although Setzer is going to open checks up. I think you're gonna play for my own. Uh, dead check or lance. So. Where am I going? Yes, here. It was just an Esper in Setzer. Esper, Setzer. And yeah, if we're doing. Find another character, then that's for some late, late arrivers or uh, joiners, we're doing kind of a co op, sharing info, talking to chat. We do know where boots are, they were in a couple places. I mean, yes, that's what could be a jumper. Let's see, can you use the aura lance? He can. Right. And he can use the red jacket. So actually, um, Setzer can use the uh, dreaded boots then. And if, when an F3 would get paid. Doing Setzer's calf, which is realm. I also hate when the rust red guy hides. <laughs> I've panicked a couple of times for sure, being like, "What do I have, Cyan? Did I get him? I thought I got him." Like, <laughs> realms in the cafe with natural. Uh, you said natural jump. Natural jump. Oh, nice. Although um, we haven't found horn or gauntlet yet. Yeah, we haven't found anything. Really. Mega elixir. In World of Ruin, World of Culligan, Item Shop. There's a four shield on Sozo. Oh, there's the enhancers. Yo, Matt Realmos has base 52 magic power. Wow. Okay, then I'm definitely gonna go to Dream after this. Yeah. I don't bother with, well, third check is or plants, but it's not I guess get rid of Go Go? Yeah, I guess get rid of Go Go. Yeah, for I see Moogleplex in chat. I, I, how are you feeling so far about co-op? Is it, um, is it different? Feeling, you're doing better than I am. I'm kind well, of. We are on a team, so yeah. we are doing good. That's the thing to keep in mind. Ooh, experience egg is the drop off of Zozo Dragon. I am That's, just getting lucky. <laughs> you're just getting lucky. Yeah. I'm finding all the dead chicks to open. <laughs> all right, Mount Sozo is Sabin or Sabin. I say both. Muscle Man. Prince Muscle Man. So if I have Sabin at Zozo, do I still do Dream or should I? Well, if you want Realm with the 52 Magic I power. do want Realm. Sabin has Blitz. Sabin's Vanilla? 
going to I do want one because I haven't learned crap for anything for spells, so. so I need to uh, do that. Are there any chests of note in the dream, or should I just blow through all those? Left room in front of the bedroom is. Um, Left room in front of the bedroom has a red jacket in it. Ooh. Um, but that's it. Okay. Here, I'll do Zozo now. Because I need the experience item. Shame. Give me a dragon fight. Shoot. It was gold dragon as well. Oh, the dream music is very weird. Yeah, it's the returners music. Say the same thing about Zozo Fuse. Saban yeah. would be character number six, by the way, so we do need Saban eventually, anyways. Yeah. So we go for Bomb Rush and we think we can get to 42. That's what, that's what Chad is asking. I could, I don't know about you. Because I'm behind on levels, so I, with the experience, I don't catch you up faster. So, yeah, it'll be. Yeah. And I have more fights than you do, so I, I probably would. I, you're gonna be close. I think I have a tough call, because knowing I'm picking up Realm from Setzer. I don't know if I'm gonna keep stabbing around or not. So I already Actually, have, like I said, she's in the cafe. Got two swingers of, of big swords, so. Yeah. I think a magic user and go go might be my my squad. But I haven't decided yet. What we really need is offering. Yeah, we haven't really hit any monsters other than you peeked the Narch one, and that was like Telestar, I think. Yeah, well, what I'm saying is we need offering to proc more cat scratches for Saya, because the sky render is definitely working, which was in um, Albrook, right? Yeah. Um. And alright, look, nobody can use the Ragnarok. <laughs> We're kind of treading common ground, or areas one of us has been right now, so. Best replace Cyan, even though he has a cat scratch, I don't like this. Yeah, no first place. There's definitely some tough, tough calls to make in terms of. Or to make Sabin. If Sabin can wield the Aura Lance, then maybe I'll just replace Setzer. The sensor's kind of dead weight right now. Because if, if he can, yeah, because save it and just a better jump in. Yeah. That's what, unless he gets on fixed dice. Because we haven't found fixed dice either. No. I mean, if we find fixed dice, then I'm in real trouble. <laughs> <laughs>
No, but he has the Dragon Claw instead. But his Vigor is way higher. Okay, you know what? We'll do, we'll do Dragon Boots on him with the experience tag. That way he can learn to get Bun Rush. And we'll go from there, and then he can be multi purpose. Yeah, we have a lot of good choices for throwing that egg on, which makes it hard to like. Oh no! Not good. Not what good. What happened? I made a mistake. Uh oh. I regret, I regret everything. What's in the skies? Uh, try touch. Oh no. <laughs> I got nothing. I got nothing. Is there? Do we have any rages that cast fire? I don't know all of them no, off the top of No, we don't. Head. I just looked. Yeah. I mean, I got Fire Dance on Saban. That's something. Well, what the hell? Does this work? Nope. <laughs> Alumina Hubble works, work I think. Too. Uh, no, Alumina don't work either. You're not rocking the Ragnarok on anyone right now. Well, they can put the Ragnaroks up to Celeste. Yeah, no, I did not get a Flame Shield. <laughs> flame Shield was in. South Figaro or the Ruin areas. Put in tech armor, see if I can get a laser beam off. Nope, laser beam does nothing, so now Saiyan's useless. Oh, Brain Pan would do a uh, blowfish, right? Oh, you're right. screwed on this way right now. I just have to hope for flare procs on Celeste. That's like the only way I can get through this. And I'm not getting one. <laughs> All he's doing is casting Rasp and Snowball. Nice. Being misbehaving. So it's not, like, horrible. Except for the fact you just cast Cold Dust on me. <laughs> I curse I had to say something! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we are the commentators, so I guess we can curse ourselves. Yeah, we gotta keep it clean anyways. We can't curse them. I mean, like, way. commentator curse ourselves. Oh, I definitely commentated curse myself. <laughs> Not enough NP for... Come on, why? Here, try this, see if this works. Let's try also new things, everybody. <laughs> does Siren Mute work on Tritoch? It does! Check that we don't see it. <laughs> I think it worked. It didn't say miss. Um, it's a dead check. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> so don't. Okay. <laughs> so whatever you do, don't search the skies. It is a Megas Road, though. Heard. I'm going to go to Esper Mount. Oh, uh, 
what was the Magitech facility? The first one was the Nesper, right? Yeah, the first and the last one were both um, Espers, and the last one had Burton on it. Uh, oh, where was that fire shield? I forgot. That's in uh, oh, South Figaro World of Ruin, one of the like southwest boxes. Oh, I haven't gone there yet. Okay. Mm. Ooh, spicy chicken and Esper Mountain. Here we go. Oh boy. Oh, he stopped Coco, of course. 62 magic power on him. He doesn't need more magic power on the rules. Yeah, okay. Hit. Talk to me, Goose. <laughs> He's still fighting spicy chicken right now. Just in a... Oh, that's right. I think I'll do the first part of Bench Tech and I can do the last part. Just to catch up because I already know the second one's dead. So I'll probably just warp out of it for it. And you said that's airship? Um Airbase, I think it was. Air Force is the first one, yeah. Yeah, I think I'll pull through I can do that. Okay, avoid us for a mountain. Yeah, I don't know what the reward is yet. I think I'll be able to make it through. It's just a bit slow right now. Oh, I have a... Shoot. Chat's asking with six characters, we change our routing to only do like S for item or peekable check. Yes, that's exactly what I'm doing because I was the first one with six characters, so that's kind of what he's doing now is going after the six characters. But you got Realm right now. Yeah. Right, so now that we got that, now we can just focus on doing some like, I don't know, I might end up doing, I'd probably do the Sabin series after this. Yeah. Because I'm not going to bother with doing um, Magitech 2, because I already know it's dead. Mm -hmm. So... Which uh, Sabin check are you thinking about hitting up? Because I might hit up a separate one there. Um, I'm going to peek the train just to give us a reconnaissance, because what are you? I'm 6'4", what are you? Um, six five. You're like six five, right? Yeah. yeah. I'll do. I'll do. I'll take the bullet and I'll do. Uh, I'll do the train um, waterfall stuff, like this with the corner. Yeah, I might look at my levels too, because I I could do in the camp if I don't want to that stuff. Yeah. All right. 
spicy chicken down. Spicy chicken down. Cafe with the raid. Bismarck is an Esper. Train is an Esper, it's Ifrit. With Ice 3. Interesting. Hmm. Should I immediately go there? It's late game. I want to go. Oh. I'm going to do M Tech because I feel like I want some levels. And that's peakable at least. Oh, oh that one. Or not M Tech, M Camp. Uh, camp. I might look at the monster in the box while I'm here. Ew! What's this? Mega armors? some pretty in-game things, if I remember. It's the last with 4,000 damage from the whole team. That's great. Wow, it's a times 15 for the Ice 3, so it's like instant win. Nice. More like nice 3. Oh, huh, huh. Apologies to everyone. <laughs> <laughs> wow, yeah, you're cringe and chat, everybody. <laughs> no. Good music for the train, though. Ooh, Shadow. Should I reset out of this? That was a good experience. I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna do it. You can do it anyway? Cool. Right. So it opens up a 3-1. I got like 15,000 experience from the opening fight, so this might speed up our end game here. That's pugs. Spells. Got some levels. Go, go, get up. Don't you dare kill Realm. Fights are all uh, in, in game high experience. Yeah, I'll avoid that then. Monsters. Shadow has GP rain. That's not great either. No. Because I did dream first, only one switch down. Watch this be goddess. I was right! Oh, wow. I was gonna say, I was kinda waiting until you get to don't, the end, and then I was don't, gonna go. Don't, don't come here. <laughs> Cause it's a one-sided goddess fight now, too. Oh, and... oh, back attack. Okay, I gotta 
Casper from Shadows. Dead check. How much money do I have? A lot of money. I might go try to buy up Espers. See if I can buy three. Log season cancelled. I can't believe you summoned the goddess though. That was incredible. Yeah, I kind of shot myself my own foot there. It's the problem with being the commentator and the, the racer. A commentator S cursed myself. Self curse. This is the second self curse. What? Yeah. How is that even possible? It's pretty wild. Zen is dead, but in World of Balance, it's only 6,000 gold for a flame shield. Uh, she's handing me my booty. I also haven't found any healing in this thing either. Oh, that is kind of a problem. I think we found at least, like, I guess life three is healing? Question mark? Oh, there's an oh, offering. Oh, don't pull through, pull through me! Ow! No, well, I got thunderships on elves, actually. Oh, see, then I don't want you to take the L for this. Stop Jeez. hitting me! <laughs> Why? Why did I have to rage Cyan? He's punching Celeste to death. And now she's making fun of me about casting her own rage. That's just great. Does a uh, stray cat get around the like love token counter? Or? No, it doesn't. Okay, well, I learned something. God, he just crit me, but I blocked it. <laughs> oh, she just overcasted my party. I'm out of magic. Oh god, this is bad. Diane, stop punching me! You know what? Here, this is what I think of you. Don't block me! God, so let's think God realms immune to her, like, countdown, like... Oh, I can't... That's right, I can't use my sword against her because I'm blocking myself, that's right. Uh... Thank God I got through it. Okay, so, don't. so don't, don't do train now. <laughs> don't do train. It has ice uh, three though. That's the only lure. Yeah. So. And I lost all those levels on salmon too. You did get through. Stuff. I would say it's probably worth your time to stop off in uh, Zen World of Balance. There's a flame shield for six thousand gold. Then there's also an offering in the relic shop. Uh, Zen World of Balance room. Uh, World of Balance. There is an Esper in Opera House, right? I'm just gonna go do that. I know there's an Esper there. Uh, yes. And then I might go try to buy my last one. Or I could do Train. <laughs> if I want. So Zen's dead, but it's a flame shield. Yeah, it's only 6,000. Okay. The soldier gets out of my way! <laughs> Not enough money! <laughs> I'm just broke, you. <laughs> All right. I have nothing to sell for. Hey, more earrings in the world of balance world shop. Oh, 
Oh yeah, we haven't gone to Collapsing House. That's a good point. Yeah. Well, you told me to go for the balance, so that's where I went. We I mean, that's, I'm just saying there. this is what Chad is saying. Yeah, I was checks. going to do two, but you found something oh. better. I learned that ice doesn't work on the toe cutters. No, it don't. Still learning stuff. Got to show that off. It's important. Yeah. Oh, we're an hour in. We still haven't even unlocked it. This is not working very well. Uh. Yeah. I wonder. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having a good time. I would say, and it's interesting having additional foreknowledge with like routing. I just don't know if my brain knows how to process that information at peak efficiency yet. It's trying to it's like trying to figure out what you're doing while listening to what the other person say telling you what to Yeah, it's like what I wonder if it's more I'm trying to think of is it would be better to like write this stuff down and as the teammate is going like to an area then they can like ask what's there and it, it's just like calling it out versus like in the moment kind of saying what's places i'm chasing waterfalls with the yeti So let me check. Oh, here, I'll check the rapid checks for for you. Okay. Yeah. Like, I'll like... do falling house, waterfall, and um. Um. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> and maybe tomb unless you're doing tomb. But... Yeah. Heard. Yeah, I think too. Like. I think it depends on how the scoring is for a co-op race. If, like, the fastest one counts, then I think when one person gets luckier, then I think the team would spend their effort, like, boosting that person, right? In terms of, like, yeah. what we're coordinating versus if it's, like, average across the team, then we more have to, like, work together to make sure that... It's dead. Don't do waterfall. Okay. Yeah, I'm a sacrificial lamb now, so... Um, you're the point guard. You're racking up the assists. Bonkers. How many espers you got? I will be at eight after I finish Opera House. Alright, let's oh, check the ball see if it's dead or not. House music is default battle music. There's ah. an experience egg in Falling House. Ooh, another one. And another one. We got enough to make a. Uh proper breakfast now. Hmm. Yeah, the egg is just kind of a... Yeah, it's, it's worth it's money if we have to go buy espers well, for... Well, there's Megalixers in one of the shops. I have F-Zero tunes and I'm just dealing with standard battle music. <laughs> you get all the good stuff. I'm checking the uh, monster chest too here for us. See if I'm off on it. No, that is Puff Daddy Master Pug. Chests are kind of nice, a couple of remedies and an experience egg. I wonder if I should do 
We haven't done There's no cults yet, have we? Oh, uh, do what? Cults. Uh, for the stab and check. Did, have you done that one yet? I don't think I have. Oh, cult. That. Uh, give me two seconds. I'll tell you what this is. Just hover. Just hover over. Hovering. Uh, Going to. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. Yeah. Falling house, falling house. Come, come, come. Heading. It's Odin. Going. It's Odin. It's just Odin, so it's something. Rescue the child. Yeah, um, the ch the chests are okay, just don't do the monster chests. I got the bonus egg. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm gonna peek the shops here. And... Uh, there's X potion, that's about it. Head into There's a mega elixir somewhere, though. Oh, I guess I have. I'm at, do I need to take a dragon just to learn spells? I'm trying to think of the tools that we've collected along the way. Ice 3. We have Siren and we have Odin for Espers. Um, Life 3, which I need to learn. You have the extra Esper from, uh, from Magic Tech on me, too, so... What was Leader again? Leader was... Oh, man. I did that so early. An Esper? Yeah. Yeah, the Leader. I got an Esper on you from the train, though. I need to learn... Spells... I'm gonna take right side dragon to accomplish that, though, I think. Okay. Save. Hit the tower. I'll try this one's Rex, so... Which means... I believe this heals him, if I'm not mistaken. Nope. See, Schwan's asking how I set up my KT parties. I usually put my power on the right side. Yeah, you always, yeah. There because are sometimes if I am really worried about, like with Gogo, because his power is coming from Rage, I gotta pair him with. Um, or Mimicking, I gotta pair him with someone useful. Unless you want me to. Do you want me to look for any goodies yeah. for you? I'm not even close, so just go. We're on time, though. So. Alright. That was a rough play. It's very 
interesting tower music. <laughs> some, it's definitely some Chrono Trigger. It's like final Lavos fight going on. I gotta figure out how I can freaking catch up with you. I mean, that is a consideration I take in mind. Um, Cults or Tomb or Mansion. Yeah, that's for me. I'm just doing some other scouting things right now. Esper Mountain does have an Esper, but it also has Poltergeist. Yeah. I don't remember what the Megalixes were. Um. I didn't write that I one was down. Marsh. Maybe everything was Marsh. I just forgot where the Skyrim is. Oh no, Skyrim is back in the old book, so I don't remember what I think Megalixes were Marsh. Yeah, which I don't want. Yeah, I don't think I had stopped when I faced Poltergeist. It's always a good one to have in the, in the bag. What the heck was the middle of this? at that shop after you, so that makes me feel like it was a world of balance. I did world of balance, you did world of balance. Stop. So that was the one that found it too, so I just can't figure out why. But Where did I go after? Was it Mount Colts and two? Yeah. Oh, the two. Actually, so I'm standing right on the two. So Inferno spot is pasta noodles, aka tentacles. You. Tentacles are definitely on my don't love to see it list. Yeah. Not that they're like wreck you, but they definitely. Eat up that time. I also hate seeing them at very low levels. They're yeah, they just grab you and just drain you. It's pretty bad. But the counter to that all is casting haste on yourself, mm -hmm. and that prevents them from casting slow on pretty much casting slow on you, which allows them to grab you. So, putting on running shoes will make you immune to that. Yeah. Which we do have running shoes, so... That's another Ragnarok. <laughs> and a behemoth suit. Another one. We're on with 63 magic power now. <laughs>
Actually, I get a uh, monster chest check on this one. Well, the chests have been pretty vanilla, except for Tolstoy. Yeah, it was pretty nice getting that magic power plus two Esper early on. Uh, my prediction is Terra is sleeping here. Oh, I found out my weapon in the tomb. Sand's been pretty useless. Pretty useless in this one. Should have kept Gogo. Uh, -Go. Yeah, I just threw the Illumina on him. Just have him swing. I can do that because this is not working. Because I'm versing all these multi headed foes and they just. This cash crash is useless without offering. is not a statue. Yeah, Inferno's not a statue. Have we seen Doom Gaze? No. No. I'm not gonna... I already said one out loud. I won't say any other ones out loud. Dude, I jinxed myself <laughs> so bad on that. My god. Why did I do that? Tunnel. Let's see. Guardian is Dullahan. Chess and Odin's got to stop. Pretty nice magic power for a blitzer. Yeah, I'm still four levels away. Um, soldiers. That'll give me the levels I need. There's an Atlas on or something in here. Huh, no. You're rolling good there? Yeah, I got through uh, the fire cart guy. Dataluma. Uh, oh man, middle path is not hard, bosses. Tentacles was the hardest one on like the right side to middle. So two more statues to go. Some box sets. Are they the yeah, ones I that have really sets. high magic defense? Yeah. You also have high health too. Look for blitz. Come on, man. They are weak to physicals, I think, though, as we're... Yeah, they are very weak to physical. Alright, 
left side statue is number 24. Junior. Uh oh. Okay. Gonna hit Realm so she's not. I don't have Imp, unfortunately. I always like Imp in this guy. All the chests have been just money. Oh, that's bad. So I got uh, my Shadow muddled, any GP reigns. Round. Oh, Interceptor still knows the right person to hit, though. Oh, Shadow hitting himself. That's never good. Uh oh, wall change. Let's uh, get in the air. Wait, Junior knows wall change? Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. If you, if you mess around, it's because you're getting you're getting muddled. Well, this should do a decent amount of damage. There we go. Care. Got through. It's a good question. Can Shadow intercept himself by hitting? Because I had that happen. He was muddled, and Interceptor blocked his self attack. At least Interceptor doesn't attack confusingly when Shadow is muddled. That would be terrible. Oh, wow. Saving quad nines on ice three. Okay. Screw jumping now. I put two experience experience eggs don't stack, do they? No. It is an S for two, it's right now. Uh, another leg three. And model production. Oh. Alright. Both KT unlocked. <laughs> Statue bosses are all jokes. That's a good thing. Uh, the only healing I have was I bought 10 X potions. <laughs> so that's a decent amount. And I got a couple of elixirs kicking around. My only calmness protection is life 3. Yeah, that's the one, that's the one for me. Okay, defend explosions. I do have Merton. I haven't been using it. Probably to my de own detriment. Because I have protection online. Nobody can't get to work. Mantra. If you got, if you got save it, you got Mantra. Ah. Good call, good call. Yeah, if you put Ribbon on him, you can't get Blind or Silence, too. Starlet Kieran, Starlet, Kieran. yeah, chat, chats. Yeah. Oh, it's workable. I'm not saying that. No, it's definitely Where workable. It? And everybody learned like life three by now, so it's like a low person. Yeah. I'm learning a uh, bomb rush. It's my high magic user at this point. Oh, Celeste okay. has 93. Okay, let's get 93? you. 93. Bahamut. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, I threw it on them from the beginning, and then also gave them, I think, the EXP egg. So they're just, like, out of control. And let's see what... Realm is only at 70, a mere 71. So I think we're gonna be okay. Uh, right now I'm in vanilla bum rush right now. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see, did give us decent tools. 
too. We got X. We got X zone too. We got X zone. We have everything we except. I mean, we got everything. Yeah. I mean, a hard good heal. A hard heals. You know, you know soft heals and hard heals. Yeah, Coco came with mimic. Yeah. That was a chat question that I was answering. Oh, oh okay. I was, like, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, uh, yeah, of course you did. <laughs> was like, uh, I was like, what? <laughs> Alright, tier one. That means. Still with no gear. Could be sad. What weapon am I using for Cyan? Uh, Illumina on my end. I know it won't proc, but. I don't know what's going on with Cyan right now. We'll check on that later. Shadow Sid with the raid. Thank yeah. you, Sid. You're uh, towards the end of we racists communicating with each other. I got lucky rather than good, but definitely I think wouldn't be here now without having the tips from my teammate over there in terms Aww, of shucks. <laughs> I mean because I would have hit you know I probably would have hit a lot of those dead checks at the end of the day um, yeah I was kind of the sacrificial lamb here through some of the dead check finding and chest checking because that's basically that was basically what normal was because once you get pulled ahead by like two or three espers it's like okay I'm just gonna go hit these random other ones. I think the big one was train and um, yeah. And doing the falling falling uh, falling house because that way because you were sitting on it's like do I do this or not? I could have just told you like yep go ahead come here. You're on Kefka now, right? Yeah. I can't get my exomes to hit. <laughs> You're on one or two? Uh, two. Oh. I'm just starting the tower. Really, I'm just showing the chat like what's uh, what, what just what chest you skipped. Yeah, I didn't miss, pick didn't up miss anything. an experience, not experience, like there's a hero ring <laughs> somewhere along the way I just randomly grabbed. That would be good for Cyan. Because it's all you're doing is smacking ones. Okay, there we go. Scratching. That's what Merton is supposed to be, right? If it was had more letters. Uh, sorry, what? Uh, like Merton? Is there like a 
Is it, is it Meltdown is like the... I think so. I think it's Otherly translated. By the way, shout out to what we're talking about before. I do have uh, running shoes on Saban, so he cannot be uh, seized by the tentacles. So literally, what I need to do is cast Bun Rush four times, and it can do it. Also, shout out to Double Down taking out the bad flashes for Bone Rush. I appreciate it. <laughs> I'm sure everybody watching at home appreciates it too, because I'm just casting Bone Rush. <laughs> and here comes the 10 hits. Yeah, the Bone Rush is the worst flashes in the game. Probably. Yes. By far. Oh, there's the hero. It was in the chest right after the tentacle fight. There we go. Moving on up. Chiller, yeah, that's another bad one. Side. Got a, a burning chat question. What is Saban equipped with? I mean, I could put... Originally, okay, so originally we started with Saiyan in the group. Um, he had Cat Scratch to start with a Rage, but we could not find offerings really snipers or really anything to put on them. Um, I did find Skyrenders, but that was, but you had to buy it in a shop and it was like a ridiculous amount of money. So I didn't, so that was like the only thing we could find on him, and it wasn't even proc in either, because it's only like a 1 in 4 chance I believe. A proc in Cat Scratch I believe, so um, yeah. Which is one. Yeah, I got Illumina equipped, and if I don't hit Cat Scratch, I mean, I have an offering, it's not really that great. So I wouldn't bother with Cat Scratch, though. I'm just, just swing it. Did I fight the one boss that this doesn't work on? saying is not 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 illumina <laughs> I cannot cast bomb rush for some reason. I just felt it three times in a row. That's tough. I have I have days like that. Bomb rush. And there it is. Medium phase. Double medium. This one did zero. I'm like one foot far on this blood smoke. Thank you. Oh, double quad nines and he's still up. Oh, sorry, Duel Hannah's tons of HP, I forgot. Yeah. 
That's pretty much the toughest boss that's out of the statues, though. Alright, calmness. Oh no. It's fine. We life three. <laughs> <laughs> it just always gives me a little bit of pause, even though I know I didn't. I have that moment of doubt of like, but did I though? I guess we'll find out if they don't get back up. That's there. That's not very nice. Sensor just tried to steal from Celeste. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a gambling problem, so. Yeah, I know. It's not I, mean, surprising. I, know I know he wanted to take her with him, but God. <laughs> All right, I'm at, like... oh, still get sub 140 here, but. Once again, for those following along, um, we're doing like a co-op race where we're kind of helping each other on where location, location things are, and helping each other out try to get through uh, this uh, ultra sleep seat. This is something that we kind of think about in the background. Um, we have a bunch. Of, we have a new crew of, of community managers now. I am one of them, and we are trying to test out some new ideas on some new races that we can try, the new leagues and stuff. So. If you have friends to like to play with, then you can do it this way. There we go. Clutch cash wow. grab. Oh, clutch cash grab? Did it actually grip that? Yeah, my big mistake was definitely, uh... Having the offering. Wasting the Illumina, but yeah, there we go. Crack cow. Not bad. So, Swans, if you want to jump back in the channel then chit chat with us about your thoughts and stuff like that about this whole thing, go ahead, man. Oh yeah, good call. <laughs> yeah, you make sure you hit, hit done. <laughs> Doesn't matter if I hit done, it's you gotta do it. Um, this, yeah. uh, I would probably just mute my audio though. That was interesting, yeah, I'll do it. I mean, we didn't. We never ran into any hard walls. I know you conjured a couple of. I. Why did I say? Oh, watch this at the end of the screen. This is going to be goddess. <laughs> like, why did I open my mouth? <laughs> I forgot I was comment. I thought I was not commentating. Commentating, I guess. <laughs> um. And I think this shows a little bit that it's definitely you know. Sometimes those times come down to picking the right direction when, you know, mm -hmm. we don't know what the right direction is until we, until we start going. Um, I never could find a gauntlet either. I was on the lookout for yeah. a gauntlet, but... Yeah, I couldn't find Atlas Armlet or Gauntlet or anything. 
I never could find a gauntlet either. I was on the lookout for a gauntlet, but. Yeah, I couldn't find Atlas armlet or gauntlet or anything. Mm. But yeah, the offering Illumina combo was not optimized whatsoever. Uh, but with an experience egg and magic power plus two, we are we had pretty powerful party members by the end of this one. Yeah, I just wish that we could get a cyan fully on online though with that cat scratch though. It just the the, the problem with cat scratch is you need ex particular items for it to work. Like we found Ginja Glove, Skyrender would have been good enough. Um but you need offering too and it's just you need so many specific items for that it's ridiculous but funny enough that is like the second restream in a row i think i got like cat scratch <laughs> yeah it's pretty interesting because it's kind of uh I feel like it's pretty rare to see in a lot of flag sets with just the amount of starting rages that we tend to get. Yeah, which also, that's why you want Sniper, too, um, on Cat Scratch, because that, oh, that would have been in incredible. That's my um, favorite. Because Sniper works the best there. So are there any, any tiers in particular you're concerned about kind of given what we what, t what tools we have here um not really i mean do we have all the base tools for this honestly so really yeah. it's just remembering that you have like three and, and if it gets disenchanted by like magic yeah honestly the only thing i'd be worried about with this is running out of uh, magic power magic uh, points for casting Yeah, it'll be interesting to kind of think about a little bit more of the tactics of co-op racing in terms of what's the best way to, like, communicate um, information back and forth and how, like, routing is different when you have two people yeah. tackling the... Uh, Or two or more people tackling the same. Right, try to get off this way. God dang this stupid blitz! Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Why? Oh, there we go. Pearl. Oh, well, just mute my stream and just have our mics only then. Hey guys. Hey, how you doing? Oh, okay. All right, all right, all right, I'm all right. I'm gonna try and do this, even though I get like double feedback. <laughs> well, just mute my stream and just have our mics only on. Yeah, but then we miss all the sweet tunes. Oh, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. Um, so, yeah, basically, I think that... Uh, yeah. Part of the co-op experience... Yeah, it's you're like, it, unless you're, like, writing it down as they're, they're saying it, it, while you're trying to do something yourself, it, while you're trying to do it as fast as you can, it does yeah. get a little weird. I don't know if it would behoove somebody to have like, like a pit crew person to try to figure things out with. You know, maybe. I mean, yeah, it could. It could certainly get interesting that way. Um. By the way, triple, triple. Here we go. Triple Esper cast right here. <laughs> back to back to back Espers. Watch this shit. Yeah. Sorry, my I, language language. I I, th <laughs> I think that well. I usually don't like to cast Kieran until I get to just because uh No just because magic could dispel you, right? And take that yeah. off of you, right? Um but but yeah, so lots of we got some decent tools this seed. It's oh, just a matter of making them making them all fit, right? We got fire magic, we got ice magic, we got mute and death and life three you know um 
Very interesting. Very interesting seed. I love starting with Cat Scratch. It's always a lot of fun. Yeah, I wish it would proc a lot more. It did not proc very often, though. I think yeah, that one works. Yeah, I think using Rage is probably one of the most fun mechanics. It's just odd because you can't control your character, right? But I always like casting spells that I don't feel like I'm supposed to be casting. Like, you know, ooh, you get Gigavolt. And it's like, well, it's just Volt 3, right? <laughs> yeah. Or like uh, Flare Star. Like, it's it's cool to cast some spells that you get to use. That's oh, we have Stop. Yes, so you learn Stop from the Odin Esp, um, which is why I was saying in the chat, if I were if I were you, I would have went to Esper Mountain for my last Esper doing... Oh, Owser's name. Yeah, we got a lot of characters up front. When when you get a lot of characters uh, in a row, is that something you typically like or don't like? Um, I can answer first. Well, we got some menu. Yeah, because I on. missed the question. <laughs> um, I would say, um, sometimes it can be. I would rather get a late character because they come with levels and late characters. If you have like any rods or shields hanging around that can at least do something in the final like statue fights um a chain of early characters it it presents a lot of like choices and and then it's usually i think beneficial to go through those early characters checks cuz they're more likely to have espers right. i believe yes or at least somehow, that's like, that's my understanding of the algorithm too. You're, yeah, your you know the characters you newly recruit are more likely to have characters in their decks than your. Yeah, I, I try to find my six characters as fast as possible. Time that's my overall general strategy. Find your six characters. Switch to doing expert item checks or. I've recently been switching more into, you know, do the fastest check possible, sort of, instead of uh, doing the stuff that's not peekable in the beginning. Yeah. Right? Um, I don't know if that's... it's Again, it's a different strategy, right? This is a speed run after all, so doing the fastest checks all the time you think would net the best results, but that's where part of the rando strategy... Oops. Yeah, especially yeah. with not knowing the rewards a lot of the times that there are definitely times that like a slower check um can provide something that makes this overall seed faster. And that's why I'll tend to like take a slow one early on, um, like a burning house or even elite river. Um as long as I feel like I can get all the way through to the end, because I've had that bite me a couple of times um, yeah yeah well i was going to say something about my ultra salute but i know somebody yeah, can't say it yet <laughs> i know somebody i know somebody in the chat hasn't finished our seed so i'm not gonna i'm not gonna say it but uh, i did something that i thought was gonna lose me time and i ended up finding something good you know and finding something that was useful for the rest of the seed so it may have lost me time, but it might have saved me. It lost me time in the, in the short term, but it might have saved me over the long term because I had something I could use. You know? Yeah, I, I had the same the thing faster. in my race too. So like, I did something that was very unorthodox and came out smelling like roses on the backside of it. So. <laughs> Which is something we're thinking about doing is like we're doing like maybe do like a highlights of like the previous weeks like ultra sleek stuff. Yeah, it's something yeah. we have just something in the works with the uh, in the community uh, management chat right now. So we're thinking about other things to add to like all our channels and stuff. Some ideas, ideas. Yeah, yeah. 
Hey, girl in the first try with bum rush. How's that, huh? Boom. Oh, nice. you are you are ahead of the stream, so. No. <laughs> um. But yeah, so what else? What else was this? Um. I mean, was it interesting to like listen to us try to like tell each other things and then also remember those things later on, or um, as it like you know. Yeah, be too, well, like... well, well, yeah, because you know you did say, "Oh, there's a flame shield here," and obviously uh, it taught you fire three. Whereas when Saber Wolf went to do the first the sky spot and it was try talking, it absolutely nothing to do, right? Yeah, and I was kind yeah. of like, "Wait, didn't you get those flame shields?" And it's like, yeah, yeah, that's the whole thing of memory retention where we're trying to run through there. It's like, oh crap, I forget to get the flame shields that could have got me through this. I like, should have just done that first and just. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. We didn't necessarily coordinate, you know, that we were doing this uh, <laughs> ahead, of the, ahead of the stream. But I think with like a little bit more like thought in terms of, I have to write things down to remember them, and so yeah, it's always that question of like, is it worth the time to stop having my character run around oh, so I can no. quickly like That's type awesome. a note? Bro. Um, or it would be like just having like a shared chat oh, thread between my teammates. Yeah, nice. yeah. Be, uh, like better where you would just like, you know, as you visited a place, take the five seconds to type out anything yeah. of note so well, that someone could go back. Well, and I th look. I think what might help, and this is gonna this is gonna be hard to do because at the beginning of the seed, both players start with nothing, right? And that's the time when everyone tries to loot. Especially is, Celeste. <laughs> it is, is, you know, if you guys looted at different times and you're like, well, I'm in this shop now while Saber Wolf is going to do a check or vice versa. Uh, right? I think you might be able to retain more of the item information. Because not only are you trying to figure out what you're doing when you're looting, but trying to, but trying to pay attention to what somebody else is telling you, like, there's earrings here, there's flame shields here, and it's just information overload because it's coming it at you from both ends. Right? Yeah. So maybe that's, you know, that's what to do next time is have one person go, all right, I'm going to do all the free checks right away, and somebody else, you go do looting and shopping, and then, and you know, at some point, and then, cross paths. right, then when you're done doing the free checks, go, all right, I'm doing doing my checks, so you start doing your checks, and I'll do you know, extra shopping that you may have missed in different towns. Maybe maybe that might work better. I'm not I'm not sure. Again, I've never yeah, done I've never done a partner race like that. So do it'll it be more interesting. And experiment. Yeah. The first step is showing it off, which we're done today. So So mm -hmm. I know that you had talked about doing, you know, a sort of uh like team based tournament thing. Is this sort of what you had in mind was doing something like this where multiple player multiple teammates are playing the same seed and whoever gets the lowest time or whoever gets the highest time like that's heck is that that's sort of what your thought process was here yeah i think um but i think having like more than three people on a team would get way too confusing so i think you'd have two runners maybe one one coach, person either like navigator coach yeah 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 navigator coach kind of thing yeah Thanks, because dude. i definitely remembered all of the stuff that both of you guys were doing and maybe it's because i wasn't actively playing at the same time maybe that's the, the way to go is you have one person be sort of like a scribe if you will and they're the one that writes everything down so that they can tell people so that this way, when Saber Wolf's like, where's these Mega Elixirs? I would tell you, oh, I remember they're here. Right? Yeah, I could not remember either. Because <laughs> like, <laughs> it was like, oh, I didn't write that one down. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so so Fitz, this is sort of what you're thinking about for a, a, another act. Yeah, it's just like, you know, it was just something I was been curious about um, and wanted to try out more to figure out kind of a little bit of the logistics, like what would feel like the right set of rules. And I do, yeah, I think after this one, like, like two racers, one support, um, could be nice. Uh, 
I'm still not sure if it should be like average times, you know, fast times, slowest time. I think I would lean towards either average or yeah, I think an average um, time of the part lowest. of the group. I mean, like yeah. or, like the the second finisher because uh, I wouldn't want that coordination to necessarily like stop when the first person had finished. Although we were both in the kind of in the tower and. Yeah, yeah. And there weren't two tricky bosses in there, so there wasn't really much to communicate at the end. Yeah, you'd um, have to sort of figure out what's fair, right? And the rules will determine yeah. how people play. Because if it's fastest time wins, then you're just like, I would have one person just running around and going to see what all of the bosses are like immediately when the seed started, right? So. Yeah. Which would be a different style. And it's really just a question of, you know what we think is what we think is fun and we'll have to try out some different things to kind of figure it out very cool all right well we both got under two hours and again saber wolf definitely helped me go faster um yeah because there's the, the other stuff by the way and i'm sorry i was focusing on yeah. trying to kill kepka um <laughs> the other the other style of running that we that we also debuted in the past was to have like somebody who has knows like all the flags and everything the um rally car style where you have a navigator next to you that knows everything and you have one person just running and they tell you it's like okay make sure you do magitech facility because it is a triple esper and stuff like that like knowing what stuff is i mean i don't know but also by the same token it's like you kind of want the mystery of like trying to figure out trying to figure out the puzzle and not have yeah. like all the answers too so i think this would be like maybe an alternative to that where you can you need to still like figure out the puzzle as a group and a team but not like and then not like not know the answers and everything and having like two or three people i don't know if, i don't have about having more than two people running with like one support person yeah. and then taking the average kind of like t tandem cycling in olympics like we, what we said at the beginning beginning of the whole mm -hmm. stream and like having that one person coach on the side like giving you like the times like whether like kind of style and like writing everything down the notes and everything so yeah i think having a third observer or coach if you will is definitely might help speed this process yeah i think it would be a key role so that it is a little bit much to be playing trying to remember things to yeah. like communicate and you later. could also and you could also give advice right i would you know yeah. when i saw oh we have stop on something go do this right so it, it, it's similar you know it's kind of like moogle's first tournament uh, i know when i was doing my mentoring i wasn't necessarily like telling people what to do but it was more like hey here's what we've got what do you think is best right and and things like that so yeah that would be a fun role to sort of play by the way saber wolf don't yeah. forget to uh exclamation done oh yeah so we can close out the uh, chat <laughs> yeah times um, don't matter here um but yeah it's uh but yeah, three. I think three player teams is certainly the way to go with two playing. I think so you could yeah. also restream that too, because you could have like two on one side of the screen and two on the other side of the screen. You still like restream that because you have two players running. Yes, yes, yeah. yeah. The so I, I would love to do like sort of a production thing where I know like for certain like esports games they have features where you could listen in to like what the team does when they're talking and. I think we might be able to pull that off. You, we would just need to coordinate it and figure it out, like from a broadcast standpoint, right? Because that would be interesting to just do game audio most of the time with commentary talking about the runners, and then every once in a while punch in and go, "Let's see what these guys are talking about." You know? Yeah, you need a you need an ISO audio board to do that with, um, because unfortunately OBS just pulls from whatever you're hearing in your own headset that's pretty right. much what it does um yeah. there's a way of doing it but you have to be in record mode to do it that way uh you can pick which channels things come down on and then you have to re-edit it through yeah it can, it can be a mess that way which is a mess yeah and then that's not live streaming either 
So well, you, think... you could do it with virtual audio cables, but again, you need yeah. to know what you're doing, right? That's kind of... I've tried using it before, and it's very confusing, so I gave up on it. <laughs> yeah, I think, but I think pulling, like, one person's stream that has all the mics and the net sound underneath it and just sticking with that is the only way. The only problem is, like, when you don't want to listen to other people and you have, want to listen to commentators, then you have no audio. Yeah. Like, you have no nets, is what I guess you could say. Yep. Unless you... Nah, there's no way of doing it, really. Yeah, yeah. Because be... you can't tell one of the runners to mute their, like, team speed, or whatever, Discord. Yeah, um... yeah, it would it would be... But it's an interesting, you know, thought experiment, thought exercise, sort of. Yeah. So, any other thoughts, I guess, before we uh, we get the heck oh. out of here? Thought side note on that. Um, how I went around it when we were doing um, the uh, rally racing one is I just put, like, Final, uh, Final Fantasy VI music tracks underneath through um, Spotify or whatever. And I right. just used that as background sound. Mm. Yeah. Didn't match the video, <laughs> no. but it was something. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's what they do for speed gaming, too. They play like the OST. Yeah. You know, when. Uh, and that's what I'm doing now. I'm playing our random playlist. <laughs> as we're chatting. Um, other uh, final thoughts. Um, I mean, the seed as a whole was okay. Um, I know it, it was hard to listen to somebody and trying to do something at the same time. That's mm -hmm. why that third utility person memorizing everything it's like and also side note for me and fitz we never raced together before no <laughs> like outside of like head-to-head -head matches through the ultras ultras league because we're both in the same potion b group right but we've never like raced side by side as a team so we also had that i don't know it's like i'm going against us but we just we just don't know each other in that respect so by having that third person Saying like, hey, Saber, don't forget you got to get that flame shield out of, out of this check, you know? Right. Yeah, it's a so, spot. Right, because somebody who's, you know, because it's difficult for somebody who is playing to coach somebody who also plays, right? Because you're worried about what you're doing at this point. You know, when you were doing the final bosses, you were sort of not talking, right? Which is how it's supposed to be. You should have to concentrate on what <laughs> Yeah, it's like the only thing I said to him was like, don't forget you got elemental shields. Yeah, yeah. Just so you yeah. break them and break them on Kefka. Fitz, final thoughts? Final thoughts. This was fun. Love to see some more of it. Um, I'm always down for co op races. So. Definitely. And uh, again, plug the, the Twitter, which was at FX6 underscore. Yes, yeah, FX6 underscore WC. The Twitter is back up and running. So the uh, Twitter machine will be announcing any future races that might be coming up. So you keep an eye on that. And also follow the website in the Discord that Swan's lovely put in the chat. Yeah, I'm going to also say give our showcase people a follow. Ooh. That's you guys. So thank you for doing this and setting this up. You know, this is uh, not the usual race that we're normally used to seeing on Worlds Collide. And hopefully it'll give people some insight as to... You know, when people are racing, if, you know, when we talked about or when they were talking to one another about what key items are where, right, those are the things you should be paying attention to doing your shopping or you doing anything. Um, yeah, we forgot where Megalurxer was. <laughs> that was <laughs> That killed me. It's like, I told me a Megalurxer somewhere. I don't know <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh. But, but, yeah, awesome. So thank you guys. And, uh. We do races on Saturday nights if there's staff available. We do them on Wednesdays on Speed Gaming, and we do them Thursday nights here. I don't know when the Moogle's first tournament uh, losers bracket finale match is going to be scheduled. We just did the semifinal earlier this morning, um, or earlier, or yesterday, depending upon where you are in the world time zone wise. Right? Um, That's cool. <laughs> But yeah, it was that one was a really fun race to watch as well. So it's it, uploaded onto YouTube now, I believe. So go check that out. Yep, it's on YouTube. I believe it's deb I believe it's premiering as we speak. So you can switch over that to watch rewatch that race right now. Hmm, and um, also, 
if the loser wins the fi- grand final, the bracket resets and those two players have to play each other again. I we don't know if it's going to be immediately after, so it might be a big, big long uh, stream. We don't know yet, so yeah, we'll see. So it is, yeah, it is double elimination. So whomever comes out of that will have to defeat Gar twice. Yep. Okay. Well, thank you guys again, and uh, I don't see anybody else who's streaming Worlds Collide, so normally this is no. the part where we raid somebody, but womp womp. <laughs> raid YouTube, no. <laughs> yeah, so thanks everybody, and uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.